E. Jean Carroll took the stand telling the jury, I'm here because Donald Trump raped me. The 79-year-old advice columnist says as she was exiting Bergdorf Goodman one night in 1996, he was entering. Hey, you were that advice lady. She replied, hey, you're that real estate tycoon. He asked for her advice to help buy a woman a gift. She suggested a handbag or hat, but he said lingerie. Carol says he was personable and engaging, very joshing and light, and that she was flirting. She testified he grabbed a lacy bodysuit and told her to try it on. She replied, you put it on. It's your color. We were having a good time joking. I thought he would. He said, let's try this on and brought her to the dressing room. She says he shut the door, shoved her against a wall. She hit her head. Carol says she was laughing as they walked in and continued to laugh because I thought it was a mistake. She pushed him and stamped her feet, she says, making it clear she didn't want anything to happen. But he pulled her tights down, she alleges, and raped her. Eventually, Carol says she got a knee up into him and was able to leave. At the start of the encounter, she testified that she thought this was a funny New York scene, a story to tell everybody after, but it turned absolutely dark. She became emotional, saying she felt shame and blamed herself, that she should have screamed. It left me unable to have a romantic life again. The former store manager of Bergdorf Goodman during that time period testified it was not uncommon for the floor lingerie was on to be empty and dressing room doors left open. Trump posted on social media this morning that the case is a made-up scam and that her lawyer is a political operative, among other things. The judge told his lawyers Trump's recent posts were entirely inappropriate and could bring more legal troubles.